up here with Layton Gaming. We've got a really fun one next tonight. Two of the brand new White Schwartz Premium Booster Boxes. Thank you again for grabbing these, Guardian. Uh, this should be really fun. Brand new product once again. Available exclusively on DripShop.Live. It is, uh, it's going to be 60 plus the shipping and stuff for the um, Marvel version. And it's 65 for the Star Wars version. So best of luck here. See what we can grab in these. What's up, Hawk Doc? Welcome in. Started with the uh, Marvel. Started with the Marvel. Good luck, good luck. I have no clue how to open this, if I'm being honest. There's probably a fun way. I feel like there was a fun, fancier way than that, but it's okay. <laughs> Empty there. Good luck here. So we're looking at uh, one, two, three, six packs. Appreciate it once again on the order, man. Should be fun stuff here. Um, I I couldn't exactly tell you. We're about to find out, Hawk Doc. <laughs> We're about to find out. Um, the big chase is going to be like these gold stamp cards. Uh, I can give you a look at those in just a couple minutes. Actually, let's just do it right now. Let me pull up a couple of uh, pictures really quick. Not really in a rush. Show you guys what we're looking for here. That way, if we see one, everyone can be excited. Give me just a second. Grab some of these pictures. Um, so this is uh, one of the nicer chases from the Marvel products. It's got that big gold stamp right on the front of it. And then this is the big uh, card from the Star Wars, I believe. This is going to have the Vader and then a big Star Wars stamp right on there. Super cool. Uh, let's see. Here's a couple other ones. Captain America, Guardians of the Galaxy. Yeah, they're beautiful, though. They're beautiful. So let's uh, hit some beautiful cards. Let's see what we got here. Thank you, thank you. I believe it's a one-card pack or just a couple cards? Yeah, it's just a couple cards. A few cards in each pack. Literally two. Oh, wow, does that look nice. Oh, wow. Woo! That is gorgeous. Beautiful start. Man, that looks sick. Then one uh, base common at the start. Interesting, man. Very interesting. That is sick. Woo! Yeah, these are new, Dan. These are new. Yep. This is the... um. This, once again, is the Marvel version. Uh, Marvel premium stock. Or, excuse me. This is called... The um, exact version of it is... Premium Booster Box, White Schwartz Marvel. And then this is the Star Wars version as well. They're pretty affordable. It's $60 for the um, Marvel and $65 for the Star Wars. They're available exclusively over on Drip. If you want to check them out, I'll drop you the uh, link. That looks crazy. That's a nice looking card there, more than anything. Uh, so there's a link, guys, in YouTube and Twitch. These are only available right now on the Drift Shop. You can check them out there if you're interested. Beautiful card again to get it going. I'm kind of excited to see more of these now. All right, here we go. You get six packs with uh, two cards in each. So it's a pretty quick rip, but it's a fun one for sure. Oh, look at that start! SP! Marvel! Avengers Infinity War! Boom! Gorgeous card. Wow. There you go, Chris. Infinity Wars SP stamp. That is gorgeous, man. Look at that. With Thanos on the top and all the other uh, Infinity Wars characters. You got Hulk in there. Oh, that is so sick. Nice SP. There you go, Chris. That is sick, man. Wow. Very, very nice hits. Congratulations, Chris. Good start on those. Keep on going here. Sick card, man. Base. Woo! These look great. Oh, wow. I'm pretty excited to check out the Star Wars now as well. Get some sleeves. Woo! These do look great. How you doing today, Dan? Welcome in, though, man. It's actually kind of nice looking as well on the base. Ooh. This is going to be a rarity of uh, IFP. 
I forget what the IFP rarity is. Once again, great looking foiling. Like that, uh, it's like a drip foiling almost. <laughs> drip foiling. Wow, nice Captain America. Jeez. Dude, these are cool. <laughs> that looks so nice. I just like that little, uh, that, uh, vertical foiling. It's great. Nice, Dan. Nice. And last one. Thanos. IFP. Sick hit there again, Guardian. Whew. Beautiful, beautiful. Congrats there, man. Very nice. All right, and let's check out the Star Wars, uh, version now. Here we go. This is exciting stuff, man. Star Wars time. Nice, Guardian grabbed up three more. Appreciate that. Thank you. Those are three more of the Marvel. Nice. Nice. Empty there on the Star Wars. Good stuff. Thank you, thank you. All right, done with the first one. Let's see what we got here on Star Wars now. Good stuff, man. I love the backs of the Star Wars ones. That's right. Love the card back for these. Ooh. Ooh, that reminds me of the um, Chrome Galaxy base card number four on Solo, or base card number one or whatever it is. It's like the cutout of that. Wow, starting with the Darth Vader. Starting with the Darth Vader. Dude, look at the foiling on the lightsaber. Oh, that's cool. There's like no foiling on the cape, but then you do get the foiling on the lightsaber. That's sick. That is sick. Very nice on the Darth Vader. There you go. Not a bad start at all. Not a bad start at all. Appreciate that. Good stuff. Keep going. Definitely a great touch, Barry. I agree with that. Oof. Attack of the Clones. Nice. Nice. And, ooh. That's sick as well now. On the um, Philo. That's gorgeous. Wow. Great stuff. Nice. Chris grabbed up three more of the Star Wars as well. Thank you, Chris. Appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. Nice. Hawk Doc grabbed up one of the Star Wars. Appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. Once again, these are available right now exclusively on DripShop.Live, guys. So if you would like to get one in, feel free. There's a link above in the YouTube chat. Lightsaber. That's sick. Ooh, nice. Uh, Poe Dameron. There you go. Bad. Not bad, not bad. <clears throat> See what we got. Ooh, job of the hut foil. There you go. Nice job of the hut. Why is that, Rob? Beautiful card there. Very nice job of the hut. Super sick. Couple packs left. And a BB-8. Jeez. Dude, sick characters. Should be an SP or SSP in each box. Got it. Perfect. But here it comes then. Here it comes. Should be. Should be. It's gotta be. It's not. It's not. That's a sick one, though. Make sure, though, quick. But I think they were all uh, P.O.P. in this Star Wars. Let's see. P.O.P. Uh, duel on uh, Mustafar. P.O.P. 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 So, uh, P.O.P. All of them P.O.P. Learn as we go, though. Learn as we go, for sure, here. All right. So, let's keep going. Uh, Chris did grab up three more of each. So, thank you. Got three Star Wars. And three Marvel. Let's get right to it. Thank you, thank you. See what we got. Um, let's go Marvel first, I guess. Let's go Marvel first. Yeah, we're going to kind of learn as we go here what the pull rates are looking like for sure. Definitely going to kind of learn as we go. Also, guys, these do all come from sealed cases as well. Uh, they do all come from sealed cases, just so you know. Working on uh, ripping cases for you guys. It's a case of like 18 or 24. It might be a case of 24. 
It's a decently sized case. Oh. Wow. Look at that one. That looks amazing. Ragnarok foil. Wow. Just a uh, low rarity again, but that is just crazy looking. Very nice, Chris. Gorgeous card. Once again, we're at 60 on the Marvel and 65 on the Star Wars right now. Uh, ooh, a nice another uh, Captain America fighting. This one. Locking, I guess, more so. Going. For sure, for sure, Chris, for sure. <laughs> Definitely. There's that Thanos again. Nice looking Thanos. Good stuff. Yeah, the cards themselves are standard white size. Yep. Yep. Standard white size cards. Yep. They're just very, uh, like a little bit thinner, that's all. Another Captain America foil. There you go. Nice. Yeah, just going to be a little bit thinner stock. But they're good quality. Very good quality. And, ooh, that's sick. Looks really nice there again. On the dock. Last one. Marvel number two is another gorgeous uh, battle. I love the battle ones. Get two characters on there. Very nice. All right, let's keep going, Chris. Keep going. Thor and Loki on that one there. Good stuff, good stuff. Uh, da, 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 da. Appreciate all the orders coming in, guys. Feel free to grab up some uh, product. Feel free to grab up some product. Let's see what else we got here next Marvel up. Run through all the Marvel quick. Yeah, these are beautiful, Hawk Doc. These are beautiful. Um, we don't do a whole lot with Japanese cards. It's usually just when it's like the exclusive collaborations um, that Weiss offers that incorporate other brands. So in the past, they've done uh, Marvel, Star Wars, Pixar. Uh, there's a Disney 100 coming. Stuff like that is kind of where we like to dip into different Japanese. And then every now and then with Pokemon as well. Yeah, Japanese cards are very quality, though. Super nice foiling. Ooh, nice looking one here. That looks sick, man. Wow, I love the ones that have, like, the whole squad of characters. Nice one there. Nice one there. Adventure Time Weiss. That is, yeah, that's a good one for sure, uh, Stefan. Forgot about that one. That one's super expensive now. Yep. Adventure Time Weiss. Definitely. They know space. What's up, Aggie? Another uh, beautiful Captain America. There you go. I do like this product quite a bit. Definitely some cool ones. Uh, definitely some cool ones. The foil looks amazing. Wow, that looks great. Oh, I love the blue on that. That thing pops. Check out the Iron Man. Woo. Gorgeous hit there, Guardian. Keep her going. This really is a sick set, Ben. This really is, man. Facts. This really is. Uh, another event. Ooh, Avengers Assemble this time. Nice. Beautiful. Avengers Assemble. Congrats, Chris. Guardians everywhere. Yeah, facts. Facts. Definitely a product right up your alley. Wow, that looks great again. Uh, IFP foil. Ooh. Holy cow. Wow, dude. Look at that scene there. It's a whole scene, like I said. Uh, no, not SP. All IFP so far. Make sure here again. IFP is the stamping. IFP. No, all IFP. No SPs. I'll be sure to call it out if I do see one. I believe the SP will have a stamp every time, and I believe the SSP will also have a stamp every time. The IFP will just have that fancy, like, raindrop-looking foiling. <clears throat> I believe, I believe. Gotcha, Chris, gotcha, gotcha. And wow, nice! 
SP Captain America the Winter Soldier. That's sick. That's sick. Nice one there, Chris. Another SP for you. Congratulations. Captain America Winter Soldier. Love how it has the gold plating on there. Looks nice. Great hit, Chris. Congratulations on that one. Very cool. There you go. Second gold stamp. We got one more Marvel. Second gold stamp. Good luck. Yeah, they look beautiful. That's what you're really looking for, Hawk Doc. It's going to be the ones that have that gold stamp on there. That's what you're really looking for. Same exact thing with the Star Wars. Um, looking for the ones with that gold stamp. All right, here we go. Uh, IFP to get it going. That's actually a great design, though. Very cool there. Thor in the middle. Sick. That's sick. There you go, there you go. Last one on the Marvel. Uh, no, there's no points to trip. Nope. Keep it going. And Ragnarok now on the foil. Very nice. Ragnarok, there you go. Love that one again. What's up, Cookie? And, ooh, another, uh, so this is going to be the non-stamp this time. Very cool. So you can get the same card without the stamp. There you go. There's the comparison. Nice. Definitely makes more sense now that we've seen that. What's up, Wilson? What's up tonight? How you doing, uh, Gunster? Wow! Let's go! Avengers Assemble! SP! Avengers Endgame Stamp! There you go again, Chris! Awesome hit, man. That is so cool. Whew. Beautiful hit, Chris. Nice one again for Guardian Cards. Avengers Assemble SP. Whew. Looks great. There you go, man. There you go. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Ooh, Black Panther. Nice. <laughs> right, Chris? This is <laughs> me, you, Ben, uh, Stefan. There's like a lot of people. Hawk Doc. These are really appealing to many, many. Not just you. Um, and another great... Wow, jeez. That is maybe the coolest one yet. Um, on the foil IFP. Holy cow. I love that one. With the massive Hulk in the background. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. There you go, Chris. What a start. What a start. Star Wars time. Let's do it. Here we go now. Let's see what Star Wars has to offer. Thank you again, Chris. Let's keep firing through these. Yeah, let's see some stamps now with Star Wars. Exactly. Let's see something nuts here. Let's see something nuts here. Good luck. Yeah, it seemed like the SP was every other, give, on, uh, give or take every other, yep. Every other. I bet the SSP is going to be the one that's going to be uh, closer to like a case hit kind of thing. Based on kind of how Weiss usually runs. Well, that took forever. I did open the pack uh, carefully and successfully. Turn it out with a Poe Dameron on the foil. P.O.P. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking as well. Yep. Ah, nice Finn foil there. Nice one there. Were they the SSP, Joshua, or the SP? So, so far we've gotten three of the stamped SPs. But we haven't gotten any of the SSPs. Keep her going, keep her going. How you doing, though? You got three of the SSPs. Gotcha. Joshua pulled three SSPs in a case break, so. So they're going to be the tougher hit, but maybe a little bit more than a case still. Holy cow. Star Wars ones don't want to work with me, though. Might have to start scissoring these things up soon. Good luck, good luck. 
Whoa! Yoda SP! Oh! Star Wars Episode 3 Revenge of the Sith. Woo! There you go. That's what I'm talking about. That is what I'm talking about. Congrats, man. There you go, Chris. So sick. <laughs> wow. Awesome looking card. Look at that one. R2-D2 and C-3PO. That's nice. And there's a gorgeous Kylo Ren now. Woo. P.O.P. Kylo Ren. There you go. There you go. Yeah, could be some good potential for PSA here. Um, White Schwartz cards also grade really well. So, yeah, definitely. Definitely. Not too tough to get uh, Gem Mint 10s of. And pretty liquid as a Gem Mint 10 if it's got that gold stamp on there. <sighs> Look at that, Luke. Jeez. Got to hit some nice stamps of these, man. Got to see some of these in stamps. Did you do uh, Marvel or Star Wars, Joshua? All right, I give up. I give up. You got me, Bushy Road. You got me. Congratulations. Ooh, sick ending with the princess. All right, good luck. Next one up. Let's see what we got for you. Star Wars, nice. Nice. Both good options. I would definitely be conflicted if I had to pick between one. I'd probably have to pick one of each. <laughs> I would be a little bit conflicted. All right, let me slice these up quick. Yeah, sometimes I get that sweet spot in the back to work that uh, someone taught me about in the past, but... It was only working like half the time, so that's kind of annoying. <laughs> At that point, you might as well just scissor it up. What's up, Nate? How you doing, man? What's up? What's up? Here we go. Here we go. Next one up. Uh, ooh, pretty cool uh, start there. What is this character's name again? Blanking right now. Next one. How you doing, man? Welcome in. Welcome in. Welcome in. No complaints, man. I'm excited. We're opening up this new product. There's an old Princess Leia. Wow. Oh, that was an old Luke? Holy cow. You're right, actually. Jeez. So old, I couldn't even notice him. You're right, though. Speaking of old, there's the old Princess Leia. Good stuff. <laughs> oh, wow, look at the Yoda now. P.O.P. Nice one there, Guardian. Gorgeous. I'm so caught up on, like, the new stuff now, Barry, like, uh, with, like, Chrome Mandalorian, you know? Literally forget about the old stuff. <laughs> How about a, uh, very nice-looking Attack of the Clones P.O.P.? Like, I saw him, and I thought fa Father of the Mandalorian with the long hair. <laughs> I was like, that's not it. Nice P.O.P. foil. Couple left. What's up, Breezy? Uh, another P.O.P. foil this time. Sick. Love the droid in the back there. Check that out. That's nice. That's nice. And one more to go on this box. And one more Star Wars left. See it. C-3PO and R2. And a Finn. All right, one more Star Wars. Come on, Star Wars. Show us another stamp here. Let's grab one more stamp from Star Wars. Good luck, Guardian. Once again, guys, if you are looking for this exact product, we do have it available on dripshop.live. You can check it out there and grab up your boxes from there. What's up, X Factor? What's up, what's up? How you doing tonight, X Factor? I'm going to drop a uh, link here for you guys in the YouTube and Twitch. You can head over there to grab your boxes of this product. We do have Star Wars and we do have Marvel. Uh, the Marvel is 60 and the... Drip is, or excuse me, does Star Wars is 65. Once again, just on Drip. Just on Drip. Old and then OG. Fair, fair. 
Definitely, definitely. That's that's definitely fair. Old and OG. 30 base, 30 hollows, and 30 stamps. Yep, I think that's exactly the breakdown, Ned. Yep, exactly. And you can get different, uh, you can get like a stamp and the base. Exactly. I do like the idea of this product. Um, and it's fun for the price point as well. You know, it's not just beyond, beyond expensive. It's, uh, it's, uh, it's a nice one. It's a nice one to casually rip and enjoy. The cards look amazing. Even just the POP foils and stuff. All right. Here we go. Uh, good question, Rob. So what happened with the Phyrexia Complete Bundles? Um, so they have been scheduled to release on March 3rd for a very long time. Um, and for some reason, a lot of stores took pre-orders, like a month or two in advance. And then they um, significantly cut the supply. So basically, if a store was expected to get 100, they got 50. Uh, they basically like cut it in half for most of the stores. Um, so now people are panicking because they um, had their pre-orders in and stuff like that. And everyone's getting them canceled. And that's exactly why we do not offer pre-orders at this time. It's just a massive headache. And uh, now they're shooting up in price tremendously because now no one has them. So it's it's all around interesting right now. <laughs> that was sick. Oh my god, look at that one. Look at that. That's so amazing. Oh. When I need to get a haircut, that's what it looks like when I wake up. Just absolute mess. Mess of uh, hair there. Chewbacca, very cool. <laughs> oh, man, that is actually awesome. Good stuff, good stuff. Let's keep going. 100-year anniversary Disney set? Me as well. Me as well. We've got our pre-order uh, in for that one. With distribution. Look at that. The R2-D2 and C-3PO foil. Very nice. Very, very nice. If you want to know which Star Wars character resembles Sam, look up. Okay, bet. <laughs> I'll, I'll look it up for sure. For sure. Yeah, we'll have some on the site once it does come out. Um, so you can feel free. Uh, I'm sure it's going to be one of those products that, you know, we'll probably have it for a couple weeks and then it'll probably be gone forever. So just keep swinging in on, like, the Wednesday days and whenever you get a chance. Check the site every now and then. You might see it listed. Job of the Hut on the foil. No problem. I can try to do that as well. Yep. No problem. And another uh, nice foil of Anakin. <clears throat> couple left, couple left. Finn. And nice old Luke there on the foil. And last one. Yeah, that'd be awesome, man. That'd be awesome. 100%. Yoda again. Ooh, nice foil to close. New guy. Good stuff, man. Thank you again, Guardian. Good stuff on the rip there. Uh, you definitely did better on the Marvel. Um, out of the boxes we ripped, I'd say. But there was still that really nice looking uh, Yoda stamp in there. So we did still get a Star Wars stamp, but Marvel definitely treated you better. Once again, appreciate you grabbing it. Awesome uh, product here. And thank you again so much. Hope you did enjoy it. Appreciate that, man.